Welcome to the uh, GLAM Underground. Uh, glad to have everyone here. Uh, my apologies, uh, we were not able to film this uh, live from a cemetery which is on Halloween, which is my ambition, uh, but perhaps next time. Um, uh, we wanted to cover the, the great GLAM underneath people's feet around the world, the, 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 the cultural institution that has the history of most people who have ever lived, <laughs> um, the, the, the silent majority uh, that, that exists in the world. Um, and it's, it's increasingly being recognized as something analogous to a museum or, or an archive. Um, and a lot of these institutions, for example, the local institution that I have uh, in, in, in New York City, uh, in Brooklyn, that's being seen as, as, as a glam-like entity. And it's, we're, we're trying to look at ways, there's a, there's a uh, user group uh, for Wiki Cemetery's user group. And we're looking at ways to, um, to, share, uh, to share this, this, uh, this cultural resource uh, that is you know, pretty universal uh historically um and so yeah we want to look at um so uh, yamin has some things to share about uh cemeteries and and the mapping of cemeteries and uh the cemeteries on wiki data and if you'd like to share cemeteries that wiki uh that would be great yes i would um, share i would share my screen to show the yeah and i can and perhaps after that i could share a little bit about uh some of my thoughts on uh individual graves at cemeteries so can you see my screen now yes you can see so hi everyone. So uh, I'm going to present this uh, new website, cemeteries.wiki. So uh, the, the the objective or the aim of this project is to to display uh, some data visualization and statistics about cemeteries all over the world, uh, based on of course uh, the data available in Wikidata. This covers uh, and it will motivate also motivate mot documenting more cemetery. As you can see here, for example, this is the all cemeteries uh, in Wikidata, and you, and it's clear to us that the north, uh, the global north is well documented, whilst the, the global south, although of course there, there is symmetries, they're not on Wikidata. So this uh, data viz will uh, motivate more people to document symmetries uh, from the global south. Here we can see different layers. Uh, it's uh, depending on the type of the symmetries, whether if it's military symmetries or uh, rural symmetries or Jewish symmetries. So for example, if you would like to see military symmetries only, so we can see here, they are mainly in uh, United States and uh, Europe. So we can change the layer, of course. Uh, here we can see different type of the maps and statistics. So for example, we can see pet cemeteries. So there is not, there is only few in Europe and uh, in the US. We can see also uh, cemeteries that are uh, uh, World UNESCO World Heritage or being part of a UNESCO World Heritage site. So, uh, of course, this is it's not a complete picture, but this is, will show us what are the missing symmetries that need to be documented uh, and to be added to Wikidata. The same thing here, we have always symmetries on the, in Europe, nothing in, uh, almost nothing in the global south. We can see also symmetries with Wikipedia article or without Wikipedia articles. So here the list of uh, symmetries uh, with Wikipedia articles. This is on English Wikipedia. We can do the same on um, on the French one. We can see here they are mainly documented in France, the main uh, concentration. Uh, we can do the same thing in Arabic, and we can see here that there is only few symmetries have a Wikipedia article on the Arabic Wikipedia, which will, I mean, this map can motivate more Wikipedia editors to, to document symmetries and to, um, to add the Wikipedia articles. And we can see also some, uh, some visualization about the number of uh, the country uh, with the symmetries. For example, we can see that uh, most, uh, most of the symmetries on Wikidata are from Italy, Germany, and France, Poland. This is the four main countries. So uh, this is the website, symmetries.wiki. Of course, this is will be more more uh, statistic and more maps will be added. Uh, also, I I invite you to check this wiki project on uh, Wikidata, Wiki Project Symmetries. Here we can uh, we will add uh, more uh, queries and we can have some statistics. For example, symmetries without uh, image, symmetries uh, without uh, common categories or without coordinate location. So to uh, the purpose, of course, to show the what is missing and to motivate uh, Wikimedians to to add more data. Uh, just uh, I would like also to to, to highlight here that uh, we can see 
uh, for um, New Zealand, for example, there is uh, an, an effort that has been done to map the, the symmetries there. Just one second. You can see it here. Maybe. You see here, you can see New Zealand has been, I mean, many symmetries has been mapped, and this and this is thanks to the to the to the effort done by local uh, Wikimedia there. So it would be nice to see all, I mean, all the countries documented like that. And finally, this is the the meta page for the Wiki Symmetries user group. So if you are interested to help and uh, to document symmetries by photos or on Wiki data, of course, uh, join us. There is a Telegram group also. We can uh, we can discuss. Yeah, thanks. I guess I, I, I would Thank just you. thanks. I would share that um, in addition to mapping cemeteries at large, like a, as a unit is one cemetery, there are also the mapping of graves of, of individuals and and markers of of individuals. Um, and there are of course many thousands and thousands of of, of human beings who have Wikidata items. Um, not all of them might necessarily have a Wikipedia article, depending on the notability of the different of the different Wikipedias. Um, but there are probably a lot of interesting. Uh, there are a lot of interesting people who are buried in different places who might have like local uh, significance, who might not necessarily have a Wikipedia article, and might be good to develop the information on their graves and on their biographies as well. Um, and because because Wikidata does not have this strict notability criteria, we can build it on Wikidata, and we can build it on outside tools. Um, I started uh, some. Sorry. Uh, I started sharing. Um, Uh, I, okay, never mind. <laughs> Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Um, I started sharing um, a bit uh, on, on the Wikisport project. The idea is that you could have um, a, say anything that you might want to share a, a biography of someone who might just be notable because they have their rel they're famous of the relative of someone famous or they have an interesting tomb um, and but also you can um, also there are a lot of commercial services that like say geneolo genealogists use things like findagrave.com which are not which are commercial and not open and not integrated with the wider ecosystems I don't think there's a really great reason there should be services like findagrave.com I think that that type of uh, service should can and should be provided uh, within the Wikimedia ecosystem.